What's up guys, this is Massey, welcome to another video. In this video I want to show you how to draw a loose structure for SF6 or sulfur hexafluoride. So sulfur has six valence electrons, fluorine has seven valence electrons. We need to find out total number of electrons. So total number of valence electrons. It's going to be 6 plus 7 times 6. That's going to be 48 electrons. Next, we need to find out the central atom. We have sulfur. On the other hand, we have fluorine. So because we have only one sulfur, the central element is going to be sulfur. Sulfur belongs to period 3, so it can have more than 8 electrons and it doesn't necessarily obey octet rule so it can be overfilled so we have sulfur in here and we must have six fluorine around it one two three four five six something like that and we have one two three four five six and for fluorine we have one Two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And finally, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now let's count all the used electrons in order to find out the total remaining electrons. So we have 7 times 6, 42, and we have 6 in here, so we have no more available electrons. So we make bond between sulfur and fluorine. And the Lewis structure is going to be basically as S. Single bond with all fluorine and we have three lone pairs on each of these fluorine elements. So that's the Lewis structure for sulfur hexafluoride. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave me a comment if you have any question. Thank you for watching and have a great day.